So just about a week ago, David Dobrik and Liza Koshy made it public finally to the world that they had in fact <laughs> broken up and millions of people worldwide, myself included, were left absolutely devastated, to put it rather lightly. They were my rock, my hope, my strength, my light in the darkness. And with their breakup, I am left with a void in my soul that I can't seem to fill. And I need help. <laughs> Why don't you stop crying like a bitch and go watch YouTube's perfect couple, Cole and Savannah LeBrand? Wait, who? Cole and Sav, bro. Huh. Alright, I'll, uh, I'll give it a look. I was just coming out of a horrible relationship. A relationship that took everything out of me, made me feel unworthy, and I'd put in my head that nobody would accept me or like me since I had a kid. <laughs> I never thought I would find somebody who not only choose and love me, but also choose and love my daughter even more. Yes. Yes, I do. Hello everyone, my name is Leon Lush. Welcome back to a new video. I am just soaking in gratitude that you would spend a few minutes here with me before moving on with your day. Today we're going to take a look at the most perfect, wholesome couple on all of YouTube. In fact, Maddie Plays left a comment on their wedding video I showed you a clip of in the intro that really sums up their entire channel quite nicely. I already cried in less than one min. And that's exactly right. I mean, their entire channel is like a, just a sentimental, tear-jerking, fucking wholesome pile of... perfectness. Now, Cole and Savannah are YouTube juggernauts, man. With over five and a half million subs on their main channel, they're regularly pulling over a hundred million views a month. And their daughter, Everly, who's like four years old, has a toy unboxing channel that's pulling like 15 to 20 million a month. I mean, these cats are making two, three hundred thousand dollars every single month for being fucking perfect. So I figure the move here is to just dig lightly into their content and see if Leon Lush can grab a couple of pointers or some strategies to help implement on my own channel, because I'm trying to get 100 million views a month. I want to be able to afford Yeezys and $3,000 Gucci raincoats. I'm going to show you guys how normal people kiss mm -hmm. versus how cool people kiss. Yeah. And we're going to give you guys 10 cool kisses to do whenever you're out in public and with, with, with your partner that you love. Yeah, this one's called Our Favorite 10 Ways to Kiss by Savannah and Cole, and immediately, I want to die, but let's dig a little deeper. So we're going to show you guys how, how boring normal people kiss and then 10 really cool kids that you can do. This is boring. 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 Ready? <laughs> boring. Wow, I don't even like that. Blow kiss. The blow kiss is exactly what it sounds like. You just blow, blow, and kiss. Ready? Kiss. Hmm. <laughs> That was good. That was good. Now this third kiss I can get behind, this blow kiss, it's cute, it's fun, it's wholesome, and I wouldn't be surprised over the next couple years if we saw the blow kiss actually start to replace the blow job. <laughs> Is this a rapid fire? It's a rapid fire. You know. Oh. Ready? Ready, go. Um, <laughs> if I saw someone do that in public, I think I would throw my shawarma at their face and then karate chop them in the throat. So, thanks for watching, guys. Um, subscribe to our channel, because we want more subscribers. Mm -hmm, we do. So do I. And give a thumbs up, because we want more likes on mm -hmm. this video. I like likes, too. And uh, watch our other videos, because we want more likes on those videos and more views on those videos, too. Okay, hold up. Apparently, Cole LeBrant and myself have way more in common than I initially thought. Now, if I'm being honest, that hole that was left by David and Liza's breakup is slowly starting to fill up again. I'm starting to feel like I could one day be whole again. Now, some of you that know me might be thinking to yourself, Leon, I thought you were married. Is everything okay at home? And to that, I say, absolutely. fucking lutely I love the hell out of my baby mama, but it's 2018. Let's stop living in the dark here, folks. Everybody knows that the only way to attain true happiness, absolute contentment, is to live vicariously through the power couples on the internet that are only showing us the highly edited, chopped up, mega highlight reels of all of the best moments in their life. <gasps> Baby, you're pregnant. I was so expecting to know. Oh my gosh! 
I honestly don't know whether to cry or to slide right the fuck out of my skin onto the floor and just curl up into a little fetus because I can't take how painstakingly sweet this is. <laughs> I gotta stop playing so much Fortnite. Blasphemy. You need to double down and play more Fortnite so you can be a real man when that kid's finally born. We love you so much. Amen. Amen. Are you ready? Yeah. <laughs> I love you. I love you. Okay. Ah, oh, that is it. I can't even do it anymore. That is fucking... That is way too fucking wholesome. Somehow Cole and Savannah have managed to take all of the landmark moments in their life, like Cole's proposal, their wedding, their honeymoon, and they've turned them into incredible cinematic, tear-jerking masterpieces. So you love this girl? <laughs> yeah. There's not a second of every day that doesn't go by that I'm not thinking about her. Cutest proposal ever, Cole and Savannah. The most beautiful girl I've ever seen. She's like the epitome of a princess, but not just the way she looks, but the way she carries herself, and how kind she is, and can out goof me in any situation, and uh, on top of all that, just how amazing of a mom she is to her little girl. It's just amazing. It's too fucking wholesome! And it really is just as much of all this as me and Savannah are, so I wanted to make it sure that it was super okay with her. Wholesome overload. Wholesome overload. We're married. <laughs> Come here. We got married. We got married. Listen, I'm all about affection and love and, you know, that incredible bond you share uh, in holy matrimony. But there's something that's just weird about it when you're doing it to, like, a camera for millions and millions of people. It's like PDA. It's like that couple at the park bench sucking down each other's throats except amplified by like a hundred million. We wanted, we've been like, for like just like so crazy in love since our wedding and we just wanted to make like a super quick video. On second thought, these guys are making seven figures annually from this PDA wholesome perfectness online. I feel like I've just been blind to this opportunity these past couple of years. I might need to rethink, might need to rethink my shit. Honey! Right, Jump cut. All right, you guys get the gist here. Cole and Savannah are just crushing it on the internet. I honestly got nothing but love for them. It may be a little bit of a perfect wholesome overload, but I mean, they're not doing anyone any harm, really. They're, they're, they're really something special. One piece of advice I can give you is that if you're married or you're planning on getting married and you want to feel horrible and inadequate about the wedding that you had or are going to have, just watch Cole and Savannah's wedding video. 10 months ago, 25 million views. It'll make you feel like shit. And I'd put in my head that nobody would accept me or like me since I had a kid. I never thought I would find somebody who not only choose and love me, but also choose and love my daughter even more. Oh, it's a celebration now. Oh, what an emotional ride that was. I'm like, I'm feeling a little down and out if I'm being honest. That was intense. Now, do you want to, fuck it, you know what? Let's try it. Let's make a wedding video. Let's see if we can't elicit the same response from our viewers. They got 25 million views on this shit. Maybe we can get like a tenth of that. It'd be fine with me. Two and a half mil, no big deal. Let's take a whack at it. Powerful stuff. 
Thank you guys so much for watching. If you could do me a favor and just leave a comment down below. And if you're new here, go ahead and subscribe. It would mean the absolute world to me. And as always, take your time. Do it gently, but with a little bit of firmness. If you could just hip thrust that motherfucking like button for me, I would greatly appreciate it. And I'll see you in the next video. Deuces. <laughs> Fucking views, views